How long do you train for a build up of a fight? How long um, if I have a fight coming up, I normally train for like um, 10 weeks of training. In those 10 weeks of training, we include swimming, fitness training, boxing training. So when I go into that boxing ring, I'm going to be ready and I'm going to be strong. When you train, and what's your favourite thing you like to do? My favourite exercises are probably going to be like, I like the strength conditioning, like doing the squats and everything, because I know that, you know, since I've been doing strength work and I'm fighting much better and I feel a lot stronger when I'm fighting. And I also like doing a lot of fitness stuff. People know me as a fighter who throws a lot of punches and has a high work rate, so I know the fitness training has to be one of the things I always do and I like the most because there's a purpose for it. When you're coming out for the fight, what's going through your head at that point? What I like to think about is all the training I've done, all the dedication uh, and discipline I put into boxing. And I know that this guy can't beat me. I am a better fighter than him. I'm more skillful than him. So I just have to stay focused. And going through the game plan, what type of movement I'm going to do, what type of pressure I'm going to put on my opponent, what punches I'm going to use the most. Like you say, you had a game plan. If that has to change, yeah. Have you got a plan B and you're straight in? We always have a plan B and a C. Your opponent's always going to train to beat you as well. So if he does something that you've never seen before, you have to go to plan B and work on that. I always bring in two or three different sparring partners. Yeah. So that way they're all different in their own way. What's the best venue you've, you've fought at? The best venue has to be MGM Marina. Now the MGM Marina, the reason why is because all the biggest names in boxing have fought there. But I think what beats that would be somewhere like in England, like having a fight at Wembley Stadium. Yeah. You know, I bought Wanderers Stadium, I bought Wanderers fans, so I think that'd be amazing. The person that you want to fight the most, who would it be? The person who I'd like to fight the most would be Floyd Mayweather. Now, Styles make fights, don't get me wrong, Floyd's probably one of the best fighters in the world, won numerous world titles, has never been beaten, and he's proven himself time and time again. Now, Styles make fights, and I really believe that Style I have, the speed, the power, the explosiveness would give Floyd the biggest problems in his whole career, and I think he kind of knows that himself, but look, time will tell. So what's your favorite Maxi Nutrition product? Uh, my favorite product is the Pro Max Milk. Uh, I like taking that after training. You know, after a tough session, I want to put everything back in my body again, you know, all the, I want to replenish myself and get all the nutrients back into my body. So I think, uh, for me, it works all the time. After the fight, what would be the first thing you, you have? Um, I normally want to hydrate myself normally first. I have, a, I have a carb shake as well and a protein shake just to kind of keep the body going. But food wise, something like a steak or carbs or whatever, because obviously a 12 round in the fight is a long time. We're in the boxing ring for like 15 minutes, 60 minutes, and we need to replenish ourselves with energy and stuff and have right food. That's only if your jaw's not broken or you can hurt yourself, yeah. <laughs> what role does Maxi Nutrition products have on your lifestyle, really? I think they play a massive role in my, in my whole career, especially like when I'm training so hard, I need the right nutrients. Very nice to meet you. Thanks Thank very you very much. much. I appreciate Thank it. You. Thank you.